Bob. Bob is a hardworking W-2 employee who made $100,000 last year working for XYZ Corporation. Like most people, Bob sets aside money from each paycheck to pay his taxes. This money is commonly referred to as paycheck withholdings, and it goes into a bucket to pay the IRS come tax time. When tax season rolls around, Bob submits his paperwork to the IRS and they determine how much money he owes in taxes. If his withholding bucket has more money than he owes, Bob would get a refund. But if his bucket isn't full enough, he would owe more money to the IRS. This year, Bob decided to go solar, which means he now has a second bucket to pay the IRS with. This bucket is called the solar tax credit, and it's equal to 30% of the price of his solar system, regardless of whether he paid cash or financed his system. Come tax season, he now has two buckets to pay the IRS with, his withholding bucket and his solar tax credit bucket. The IRS will first pull money from Bob's solar tax credit bucket until the bucket is empty, leaving his withholding bucket full of all the money he withheld throughout the year. If the IRS needs additional funds beyond the solar tax credit bucket, they'll take it from Bob's withholding bucket and give him the rest back as a refund. Bob now has a choice. He can put his refund into savings, pay it into his solar financing, or spend it any way he likes. Bob is thrilled with his decision to go solar, and he's happy to have a second bucket to pay his taxes with. Our representatives are not licensed tax professionals, and this is not legal tax advice. We recommend that you contact your CPA to best understand your individual tax situation.